This is a hepatic Doppler examination of a patient who has portal hypertension. And on this image, we can see that the liver is increased in echogenicity and has a mild lobular surface uh, along the capsule. The main portal vein has been measured and is 1.57 centimeters. This is larger than normal. The Doppler waveform of the main portal vein uh, demonstrates uh, near continuous flow into the liver. So flow is hepatopetal. The right portal vein is greater than 1.0 centimeters. And although there are no criteria for this vein, this is rather large. There is complete filling of the main portal vein into the right portal vein as demonstrated by color Doppler. The flow is toward the top of the screen and therefore hepatopetal. The left portal vein is slightly greater than one centimeter in size and the origin of the right portal vein on this image is just below one centimeter and these are in the normal range. The right portal vein has continuous flow and the flow is in the correct direction. The left portal vein also has continuous flow in the correct direction into the liver or the patopetal. Another image of the two uh, or the branching of the main portal vein into the, its two branches and uh, there is uh, no evidence of uh, thrombosis uh, on this image. Color Doppler demonstrates also that there is a complete filling of the vessel and no uh, evidence of thrombosis. It's an image of the uh, one of the hepatic veins. Uh, it appears to be the left hepatic vein. Flow is uh, toward the bottom of the screen at the time this image was frozen and uh, this is normal situation. This is an image of the uh, hepatic vein and uh, we can see in this portion of the Doppler tracing some reverse flow. This is an atrial kick. Uh, this is normal and uh, indicates normal flow in the hepatic vein. The inferior vena cava also has a mild atrial kick and here it appears to be phasic with some uh, perhaps inhaling of the patient. Uh, this is normal for the vena cava. The Superior mesenteric vein was not visualized due to overlying bowel gas. Floating loops of bowel can be seen here below the level of the liver indicating uh, mo or moderate to marked ascites. Another image of the uh, liver indicating nodularity and increased echogenicity. The liver also appears small in size. The spleen was not measured in this examination. The images demonstrate an echogenic liver of reduced size with a nodular hepatic capsule consistent with cirrhosis of the liver. Portal hypertension is in evidence by the marked ascites and the enlarged middle portal or main portal vein. The hepatic veins have normal flow and the vena cava also has normal blood flow.